We're live. We just got the tweet, the, the news for the first anniversary, boys. And um, wow. Happy one year, I guess. If you've made it this far. Hello, you too. All right. First things first, though. Uh, it's been a crazy year of Lost Ark. For those that started with the founders, it started on the 8th of February last year. For those that started um, without the, you know, the founders pact. It was 11th on my birthday, dude. That was a special day for all of us. And uh, there is going to be a drop. Now, I think you get two chests. It's what they're saying. TLDR. First four hours, you get a headband chest. And then the next four hours, you get another chest. So basically, what we're going to get is this. I don't think I've ever seen this. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I've seen the headband. I don't know if I've seen this. But th these are what we're getting for Twitch Drops and Amethyst Shards. Alright, speaking of Amethyst Shards, if any Amazon or Smile Gate employees are watching this, hopefully you guys could update the Amethyst Shards. Like I said uh, two videos ago, where I, uh, you know, directed the video at you guys. But anyways, that's the Twitch Drop starting tomorrow, uh, I believe 8 a.m. Pacific, okay? So you could join us, follow the stream. This, uh, follow this card, I guess, for notifications. But anyways, as for the anniversary stuff, okay. As for the Annie stuff, here we go. First, anniversary celebration notes. We just read it. What we're going to get is Rowan. And the downtime, same time, February 8th, 12 a.m. PDT. Expect the four hours. We're going to get Rowan. Rowan is a content next to Shushire. I'm not going to give any uh, big spoilers, but Rowan is right here. It's not a major main story quest line, okay? But it's a good story. It's one of my favorites. Uh, it, it may make you cry, but that's what they do with every conf continent from now on. They try to make us feel all emotions, happiness, joy, sadness, you know, everything. But the thing is, don't expect it to be like a major, major, major keep you busy for 10,000 hours, okay? It's just a nice story. And after you complete it, after you complete a uh, quest, you will be uh, able to decide a faction, red or blue. And you guys can read the patch notes for all that stuff. You'll be either pro Geli or Libratan. All right. And uh, you'll get a faction skin. I don't want to go too much into spoilers, but these skins you can hide as well in your character P. There is a button in Rowan that you can hide, so you can wear your regular skins. But I just wanted to tell you guys that if you hated your faction clothing, and also your faction clothing upgrades as you get higher ranks. And as for PvP, there is a PvP map zone where you guys duke it out 24-7. Now, I cannot show you that map because that's too spoilery. You guys will see it yourselves because they'll guide you there. They will force you there. They'll be like, hey, check this out. Give you silver for it. Anyways, Rowan, you guys can start at 1445, all right? There are some cards you get. We did it on stream once. There are a little bit of cards, but don't expect nothing. You know, don't expect too much. All right. It's a good story, though. Good story. You'll, you'll meet a very Coomer-friendly character there, to say the least. Let's move on. First anniversary celebration, anniversary event. Okay, so we're going to get these, like, currencies. And we're going to get an event shop, right? An event shop like over here in Korea uh, this is for Christmas it's not an event shop for anniversary but you'll get these tokens and you know, I'm guessing you're gonna get a lot of like mats and stuff like that and we may get some skins I, I don't know oh so this guy's wearing the skin right there is that pro Geli or Libratan it's the red faction but people like the red faction in general in general because uh, they like the concept of the skin all right, and you can unlock the skin and buy it once you get the tokens. They say it in the patch notes what the tokens are called. It's the it's the minerals, the red mineral things. I can't pronounce it, but anyways. Uh, but moving back to the events for the first anniversary, we're gonna get one that is time based once per day per roster, like a ducky warfare. Basically, what we do is we get event currencies, and there's an event shop, and we'll get a bunch of rewards, right? You guys are used to this. Login rewards. Uh, this seems pretty fat, right? Double login rewards with valuable rewards like epic to legendary card packs. 
uh, the rewards won't let up throughout the whole month. There will be two monthly login rewards. Uh, there's like two tracks, right? Full of birthday gifts, like the mirror ball bobble mount. Okay, so second time reading this now. So I guess we're going to get this mount for free. This variant, the mirror ball one. This is my favorite mount in the entire game. Okay, artist subjective. This is super rare. It's very boingy. Spacebar is really good. I can't show you because I don't have it. Uh, I really want one and I'm going to get it on NA. And I can't even buy this in Korea. Because once you've missed it, the second anniversary, it was gone. At least the mount, I think. It's not in the shop. So we get one for free. And then the four different variations are down below. We'll get there. All right, we're also going to get a Fever Time event that will run for a long time. With almost two weeks, right? With six login available to claim. I guess what that means is that if you miss a day or two, that you can still get it, right? Within those two weeks. So we're going to get pans, food, cards, stuff like that. Okay. And all players who log in before March 10th will get an Earling Anniversary title. This is also rare in Korea. And this title has a spe it's a blue title and it has a special birthday cake icon. Like if you've done the, what is it? Uh, the Witcher stuff, you get that title with the wolf head. But this one has a birthday cake. Pretty, pretty cool uh, for title enjoyers. Special stronghold structures, okay. And I think it's a trophy, right? Yeah, it's a trophy for those that logged in 365 consecutive days. And you can still log in from today for the next 365 days and still get it. They're going to exempt some of the uh, awful days, <laughs> like the launch. Uh, yeah, dude, the official launch and those long extended maintenance days, okay? And this pretty much means that the frog is back, boys. Toad, whatever you want to call it. The golden boy. All right, he's back. Now, is it going to go away before artists or not? I don't know, but, you know, take advantage of it, I guess. Take advantage. And they said this already. Added two tracks of daily login rewards. And I don't know how I feel about this one. One of the three weekly Una tasks centered around completing Chaos Engines have, has been removed as part of our ongoing bot prevention measures. Huh. Is that the silver one or the shard one? Okay, I mean, I already made a video um, asking AGS Smilegate to stop doing these things that hurts the players, the regular, like punishes the regular players, like purchasing something and then waiting 10 seconds before purchasing another, or the three-day gold hold. The list goes on and on. And hopefully, uh, we'll see, okay. On February 8th, added, what is this? An additional notice on bot prevention measures will be on the official forum. So that's tomorrow. I'll take a look at that. Because uh, they've been testing the capture stuff. All right. End of the festi festivity island events, but the collabo, which your collabo is still there. Decrease the difficulty of Caligo's uh, Carl. Yeah, Carl's been nerfed. Good. Carlitigos, whatever you want to call it. Store updates. Did he add the Braille mats yet? Ugh. The bro mats. Anyways, Assassin Adventurer Cosmetics. Second anniversary stuff, right? Second anniversary. Uh, that's the, the blue boy. That's the blue boy skin. And that's the mount. Thank you for helping, M39. Chat, can we get a thank you, M39, dude? Who is M39 in chat? We should give them a sub, dude. But, uh, yeah, that's the... that's the. I think that's the Libratan. Libratan, I think, is blue. And Progelli is the red. But the Progelli, I think, it looks sharper. So people, like, flock to the red side. All right. Now, as for the skin, it is not dyeable. At least, it's not in Korea, the second Annie. But as you can see, it is the most the most uh, sought after in Korea. Because many people missed it back then. For obvious reasons as to why. Vampire, booba armor, coomer bait, shit. Like, obviously, people want this, right? It's beautiful, in my opinion. It's like got a little bit of vicus in there. Got a bit of a mosquito lady from One Punch Man, I guess. I don't freaking know, man. I like it. I like it a lot. I just can't afford it, dude. <laughs> Not at these prices. But there are different color variations, right? Assassin's always blessed with the best skins. It is what it is. It's their birthright. We call that Tezeng. 
Uh, those are the weapon skins. And those are the gunners. Male gunners. Female gunners. Sarah Connor. This compound gun is the most expensive uh, gunslinger weapon in Lost Ark, Korea. Probably not for the West, who knows. But it looks beautiful. I don't think any other, no other gun skins came out that looks as good, in my opinion. Mages, no comments. And Sork, Summoner, for the first time ever, getting a combined weapon. Never seen that before. They're gonna share a weapon. Vinci, thank you, thank you. And martial artist getting the the good stuff. Oh, no weapon show. Oh, there's a weapon. I'm definitely gonna get the scrapper one. I love these. They, I don't know, like, I don't know. I don't know why I like them, but I just like them. I like all colors. Water Dancer got the Thanos with the striker. Sophus got a don't know what that is. Glaver got an ass probe. So the one here is this cat ear helmet. It's super super expensive in Korea. It looks really good with a lot of skins. Anyways, and the glasses. Those glasses. So good, dude. Same with the uh, Gunslinger glasses. Th this and this glasses are one of the most expensive face one slot items in the game. Alright, Warriors, no comments. And those are the skins. Uh, we already have a... We already watched the video about this stuff. Bubble Mount, four variations. I guess we get the... Like I said earlier... The ball mirror mount we get from the daily login. Alright. And the four other variations are in the store. And where is M39 with the mount? Is he still here? Oh, he left. But you guys saw the mount earlier anyways. And the wallpaper. Wallpaper is pretty cool. I like this one. It's the T Stadium wallpaper. T... I mean, you mean the Lost Ark logo? Alright. And... As for, are we going to get the free skins or not? Like, I, I don't know. We have to wait for the event shop. We got to wait for the event shop. Okay. And then uh, I could do a fair assessment. But that's going to be it. I don't think I'm forgetting anything. I don't think I'm forgetting anything here. That is going to be it for now. Am I missing anything, chat? Get your, tri uh, get your Twitch drops, guys. Yeah, get your Twitch jobs. I already said that, but, uh... Let's see how good these rewards are. I mean, they're talking the game, we'll see. They're talking a big game. Alright, that's gonna be it. Peace.